theory. Yeah, you should get almost the same color. So I'm still getting there. You didn't, did you do equal parts? This one looks Christmassy no. so far. Yeah, that's all I put. It looks like Santa Claus. It looks like Santa Claus. <laughs> Until I'm so sure it gets worse. So if you do equal worse. parts, you should get the same color. I know it's hard to do equal parts. If you did equal parts, you should get the same color. So this one was yellow and purple. This one was red and green. I mean, it's close. I feel like it's a little different, but it's close. Yeah. Colors creating by mixing equal parts of a primary color and a secondary color. Yellow, orange, red, orange, red, violet, blue, violet, blue, green, and yellow, green. Hello guys, welcome back to Jazzy Denise TV. I am Jazzy Denise and this is another weekly Paul Mitchell vlog. We are on week four. Today, we are not doing much. It is color week starting off. So we did some Play-Doh activities earlier where we kind of made the color wheel with the Play-Doh. I showed you guys a little bit of that. And now we are on the floor doing mannequin heads while some people are getting their hair washed because they were not able to get their hair washed last week when we did wash day so i'm gonna just set you guys back up over here and i am working on a blowout a round brush blowout on one of my straight hair mannequins uh yeah because i got my hair washed last week tie over there i washed her hair she washed my hair so we are doing mannequins today don't prove me wrong, prove you right. My word is but we don't spit no lies. A daughter of the sunshine. But every blue moon I come alive at night. I like plays and I like. doing a silk press i had already did the blow dry and uh the wash and all of that good stuff last week when we washed her out and today i'm just finishing her up with a nice little silk press but i keep everybody at a distance if i build it will y'all really come Champagne toast, still can't swim. 
process of cleaning up. It's about 30 minutes until it's time to go home. And the last 30 minutes is usually always sanitation and cleanup time. So here are my two heads that I did today. I have previously did this braid, but I just went ahead and re-blow dried her that you guys saw earlier, just to kind of work on my blow drying technique of holding a blow dryer and utilizing a brush for a round brush directional blow dry. And for her, I really wanted to do a full silk press on her and put some curls in her because the ends on this doll, on both of these really need to be cut. And I didn't want to just do a style that made the ends look raggedy. I wanted to show off the hair and the texture in a straight style, but I felt like curls would look better and it definitely did it justice. You can't even tell for real that the ends are split like they are. It kind of, it's like they flow into the style. So I was proud of that. I'm tired. Working with this uh, thing on my hand today was interesting. Today was my first day using a brace because Saturday my carpal tunnel literally became a whole issue. Like I could barely hold the brush because my hand was like cramped up so bad. It was like swollen, like you could still kind of see the bubble in between my knuckles and everything. So I bought a brace. Hopefully, you know, it serves its purpose and we do what we need to do to get through this program because baby, I was sad about it. Like what you mean my hand is cramping up like this and I'm just getting started in the program. It's only week four. But yeah, we are just pushing through with that, but I'm gonna go ahead and clean up. But I keep everybody at a distance, 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 distance. If I build it, will y'all really come? Come, 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 come. Bought all these panties, but I really don't wear none. I like boys and I like girls, but I love my Talk to y'all later. You can do better. Let me show you.